welcome to my youtube channel my name is ni hamuda and uh you are welcome in this tutorial we are going to recreate this very particular flyer i made for sir emeka nobis to celebrate his 95k facebook followers so without further ado i'm going to take you from the step one to the very end and you're going to see how this flyer was created if you're excited already, I want you to click this, the like button, click the subscribe button, and share this video. Okay? So, let's begin. Now, first, look at the size. Are you seeing the size now? This is Instagram carousel size. Okay? So, I'm going to go over it from scratch. Is that okay? So, let's go. We'll go right here. We get the size. This is 1,350. Then, 1,080 right this is the exact size okay so um the next thing we're going to do is to get a background and to get sorry make us no be some picture so let's go and get the picture we're going to be using so i pray we'll get this very very fast where are you so go to photo room let's get sorry uh, make no picture okay almost there almost there all right this is the picture we're going to be using i seen this now okay um, all right so leave that there this guy here don't worry just take it out all right okay no we want to go into getting the text effect and all that it's very simple so i want to get a background that i'm going to be using and i'm going to tell you how i got the background so this is the background that we're going to be using this guy here okay I'm going to turn it like this and I'm going to fix it right here. Okay, and I'll send it to the back. Okay, it's all right. Now, um, let me save our time by bringing the um, all the information that was going to be here. Just bring this guy here, bring this guy here, all right okay so this is going to be here like this let's adjust it all right let's adjust it i'm going to use um this font right here all right cool all right so that by the way let's quickly go and get our test effect now to get your test effect there's something you're going to do so let me show you you go over to where we have photo here dot com now i've downloaded the test effect already that i want to edit all right so i'm going to open it and show you how to edit it so go to file all right go to open go to file that is your your folder now where you, you've downloaded the um the mock-up so i'm going to go to download where i downloaded it it's called hype code tvd so this is it right there i'm going to click on it and allow it to load so you give it a little time for it to load my name is niyamuda and welcome again to my youtube channel I want you to like this video. I want you to drop a comment for me how you are enjoying the video. And I want you to share with your friends because it's very, very interesting. Not only you will be learning, probably you came across this video by just um, suggestion by YouTube. Please also share it for your friends to see and learn. All right, let's, let's proceed. It's going to be loaded. It depends on your network actually. But if you have a good network, it will take um, not so long for it to load. not so long for it to load um we pray that uh, network doesn't interrupt here but it is loading all right so it is loaded this is it this is exactly the way the test is going to look like so what are we going to do next what we're going to do next we're going over to what we have um this layer here all right right here we are going to um, take out certain things and bring in certain things now the test is what we want to edit this test right here So I'm going to get get this guy the light out. I'm going to get the background out I'm going to get the test effect out so that it's going to be just the background. Sorry, put the test effect back. Sorry test effect here Okay, look at it now All right, so now let's go over to uh, We want to put 95k inside this test this guy here so to do that we're going to go back to pixel lab okay 
then first of all let's save this project let's call it 95k all right it has been saved now okay we'll come back to it so let's go to a new file and then let's 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 do this i'll get a size let the size be um let's use youtube banner all right let's use this size so come here and type 95k all right okay then get a decent font i'll prefer um, a font that is bold actually let's use this guy um okay let's use this let's use poppins black italies all right so then increase it okay don't worry too much about dragging it just make it centralized there then go over to um, background right here let the background be transparent and let the text be black plain black okay make sure that it's 100 percent black okay like this once you're done with this save it save it as png now once you have saved it we can now go back again to um all right we'll come back here now we'll not double click you can see that ip there click to change test that little boss right there you double click on it it's going to open like this for you so you take out this one here okay you see i put i i click the eye icon so that it, it goes out so it's out we cannot come here file and bring in open and place all right click on open and place and then go and locate the pixel app design you just created and allow it to load are you seeing that now it's going to load and be placed exactly inside the boss the rectangle once it has been placed now you will now click on file again and click on save smart object it has been saved now we'll go back again here then we'll click here and we'll click on text effect sorry we'll click on text effect just wait for it to load it's loading it's loading so let's wait for it to load all right so you click on this you can see this here click on text click on text effect all right let's see so i i are you seeing that now so click on text effect let's click on the eye icon close to the text effect you can take this one out then you can take this one out then you can see now that is showing up 95 Okay. Now what do we save it? Click on file. Click on save export as. Click on PNG. Now wait for it to load. Now you will click on save immediately right here and you're going to be asked to watch a short ad before you can download. Click on OK. Now um, the ad is supposed to show like this. Right, so the ad is going to show. So just watch the ad for just um, 13 seconds, and after that, you will be free to download it, whatever you want to download. So the ad is done now. So you click on the, the ad is done now. Click on right. So the ad is done now. We cannot download. You seeing that now? Download. So it's downloaded now. The file is downloaded. So assuming you wanted to get the background. You can come here sorry you can come here you click on you you hide the test effect enable only the background you can see only the background then you go again and then export as just like that you understand that now so let's go back now to uh, pixel app and then open the file the design we're working on before so this is the design we're working on so i can now come again now and then import the the um what what we just say right here now you seen that now so 95k so we'll save it so this is it now okay you can see how beautiful it is so um we can come over here and then work on this small um, right okay all right all right all right so there is a thank you here all right so let us go thank you so we use a script font so let's go to our font 
let's use this guy here all right okay so basically we want to add some effect to it to make make it look very very nice so one of the things we want to do now is to bring a shape right here all right a shape right here all right this shape right here we're going to add a little radius to the edges and then we're going to um all right we're done with this one first the color we're going to pick from this text effect all right to bring a balance so i'll pick the color from here are you seeing that now okay it's cool right okay all right so i'm going to copy this and i'm going to go to edit i'm going to take out this opacity to zero percent i'm going to go over to stroke i will increase the stroke to just two and then i'll change the stroke color to white enabled then i'll come here i'll do this all right there's a reason why the, the color is not white because i didn't do it from the beginning so i'm going to go over here i'm going to change the color to white are you seeing that now it has been done so i will go over here and I'll adjust it to be, to be at the center and I will touch this also and adjust it to be at the center. Okay, so I'll pick this test right here. Where are you? I'll pick this test right here, which is the website to get a Mechanobis um, course. How to grow a social media that would um, give you money. So we'll click on this, click on this, click on this. All right, come over here and then paste it here. Okay, all right, so stretch it. Sorry. We can lock these guys one two locked so come over here and stretch it a little okay so we we'll just centralize it right so the next thing we want to do now is to get this guy so we're going to do this right a maker all right novice okay so this is what we're going to do now we're going to go back to here we're going to pick a test one of the script tests we can use. Let's see. Alright, is it? So we're gonna use this guy now. Sorry. Let's lock this text effect. So we're gonna use this guy now and um, use to create a kind of a background. Right? So first I'm going to use padding to bring it everything out. Padding. So pad everything out like this. Then I'm going to go to color. Sorry opacity i'll reduce it like this so this is going to form a kind of a background to the design so i'm, I'm going to copy this and i'll put it over there too all right so i'm sending to the back i'm sending this one to the back too i'm sending this all overall stuff to the back all right cool now you can see that it's yellow in the design so i want to bring in yellow effect okay so i'm going to bring in a cycle right so i'm going to go to color i'll pick this color first all right it could be here or anywhere okay and then we could also copy this and bring a yellow color so we can pick this color from here i think this is it complete this one all this all right you can bring this here all right so the next thing i want to do is to to to, to write the name and make a nobis all right so let's come over here so we just write the name here and make her nobis. All right, so we're going to use the board. Um, this one, that's what we're going to use then. All right. So the other, the other details in the flyer anyways, uh, how do we get them? So let's just go over here, go to download. First of all, Let's see how we can get this guy. What is it? Sorry, just now. I can get this guy. All right. So this guy is going to be right there. Reduce it. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. You know that's one of the ways you can support this channel. Just like and share so that more persons are going to benefit from it. So this is it. So I'm going to reduce this and I'm going to bring this right here. Are you seeing that now? 
I'm going to bring this right here. Okay, okay. So this is it. So we want to bring in um, the <laughs> the Facebook. Uh, what's it called? Facebook verified icon. If I can see it quickly, then I'm going to add. If I don't see it, then of course you can download it on your own and add it to your design. But this is just the major stuff we've done already. Okay, I'm not seeing it quickly here. So that we can save our time. Okay, so I've seen it. This is it. So I'm going to use this one. Even though it's not perfect as I wanted it. But we'll just try to use it. So... Right, so stop something like that anyways so I'm gonna reduce this a little right so um I think that is basically all that we've got here then the other thing is going to be this guy here Facebook followers so let's go Facebook followers all right okay so let's join them together close close of the line spacing all right so just get a facebook icon here which you can see almost immediately so i'm going to use this one so um because it's a yellow so we're going to use yellow a deep deep yellow so put it right there all right so this one can be here all right you can see that it's it's already there so thank you 95k facebook followers then the name here i can know this all right that is a very very great man you should follow on facebook and across all social media platforms so once we've done like this we can now begin to do a little editing to bring out the beauty of the whole work so i'm going to save right here I'm going to save it right here all right so i've saved it don't forget to save your own work then we'll go over to where we have or we can do some more editing so we'll go to snapseed okay go to snapseed and then we make a little enhancement to the design so this is it we're going to go over here and go to um shopping we're shopping the design all right you go again do it again all right sharpen it so look at the look at the design all right so so you can come over here and then do some little touch and everything and your design is going to be ready for upload so that's it we're done with the design did you enjoy this tutorial what was your favorite part and tell me where are you watching me from where are you learning from and don't forget that you can always learn deeper by clicking the link in the comments to register for the GBD Masterclass that you're going to be learning more about graphic design. My name is Nia Muda and I'd like to know what you think about this design. Don't forget to share. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to drop a comment. I'll see you in another tutorial.